after a computer scheduling glitch for American Airlines threatened to bring more flight cancellations to the already fraught flight situation this 4th of July weekend. American says most of the problems have been resolved at this point. Meanwhile, the TSA says nearly 2.5 million people passed through airport security yesterday, setting a new pandemic era record. CBS Source Wendy Gillette reports. It couldn't have happened at a worse time amid staffing shortages, weather disruptions and high demand over the holiday weekend. An American Airlines scheduling platform allowed pilots early yesterday to opt out of thousands of flights this month. The pilots union says 12,000 flights lacked a captain, first officer or both, including flights this weekend. American says it suspended the platform and restored the majority of the schedules so that operations will not be impacted. The snafu comes as the industry deals with thousands of canceled and delayed flights this weekend. We just got here. They let us know right now that I got canceled. Alam Khan's flight to Toronto was canceled yesterday before his own wedding today. I'm just going to shoot her a call and be like, uh, look, babe, I, uh, I'm kind of stuck here for now, but I'll be there as soon as I can be. The number of flyers set a record this weekend. Nearly two and a half million people went through TSA checkpoints Friday, the most since before the pandemic. But tens of millions will hit the roads, around 42 million, according to AAA. That's despite gas prices hovering just under $5 a gallon, $1.70 more than last year. President Biden tweeted to gas companies, urging them to lower prices at the pump. It's annoying. It just makes it... It makes us decide what we're doing and where we're going and try to do more things in one certain area than not. Californians are already paying over $6 a gallon, and it got even pricier Friday with an increase in the state gas tax. Wendy Gillette, CBS News, New York. Well, if you are traveling later today, check with your airline before you head to the airport. MIA and FLA also just getting dropped off by friends or family or using rideshare since the garages will be packed.